Family, you know, um, I'm 53 years old. Uh, throughout my whole life, you know, we've all been conditioned. We've all been used to the Red Cross. We've all been used to going to places and, you know, donating the blood. Well, I, I can't donate blood, but you know what I'm saying. We are all used to Red Cross collecting blood, right? But, I mean, like, it's the first time I've ever seen a place that just says, like, you know, look. Come come here. We we want your plasma. You know, people are going here, especially a lot of the homeless. You know what I'm saying? Because that's who that's who most of the donations are coming from. The homeless people who are they are paying for their blood, for their plasma. You know what I'm saying? Because they already have them in a certain way and they don't want to help them with no other nothing that they need but they will pay them to get their blood and then send them right on back the fuck outside you know what i'm saying but i've never seen this before ow okay y'all sorry about that but i've never seen this before you know where they just outright have whole fucking buildings that just want to collect your plasma you know i like to remind people all the time that we're these motherfuckers life source we are their life source okay Without us, there is no them. They cannot live. They feed and live off of us. So, all y'all thinking they're going to just, oh my goodness, just turn around and destroy all the damn humans? Uh, no, they need humans around. They need us around. Because they literally feed off of us. Literally. Okay? The blood. The blood. <laughs> the blood is precious. It's their life source. Our life source is the source, the creator of everything. Their life source is us feeding off of us in every single way, feeding off of our energy, feeding off of our uh, intellect, our intelligence, you know, feeding off of our emotions, feeding. They feed off of us. That's why they like us angry, distraught, distorted, you know, feeding. One thing I learned is, you know, clear out everything in you, everything in you. I'll be like, I'll be trying to devil proof myself. You know what I'm saying? Clear out everything in you, everything that makes you connected uh, to this world. You know how that little scripture says somewhere, not of this world, but in this world. Vibe on that. The vibe on that. Not of this world, but we're here in it. You understand what I'm saying? And then take it on a deeper level and clear out that shit in you. Whatever the fuck ties you got here that make you might, you know, here, anything they can feed off of. They feed off of your emotions, your hate, your anger. You know what I'm saying? If they can cause that, they feed off of it. Okay, hate, anger, grief, none of this is shit that we were uh, used to, accustomed to, and none of that shit, okay? Because we're from life, we're from the source, <laughs> you know, we're not from none of that shit. So they give us these things so they can feed off of our emotions, feed off of that. They have no fucking emotions, they have no love, they have no soul. We got to stop looking at them like they're us. They are not. These motherfuckers got a whole fucking building set up now where they just outright ask for your fucking plasma. In these times now, where everything should be more evident, where everybody can see what the fuck is going on, and they got big ass fucking buildings, like, come on, let's get that plasma from you because that's their life source. They're not hiding near shit. You know what I'm saying? But you need to know what you're dealing with. You're dealing with the fallen. Okay? The ones that watched our creation then got pissed. Because our creator had children. And we're here. And we're the most superior beings on earth. They are the domesticated pets. All of them that you love. All of them running us. I don't understand how the fuck that happened. But... Um, all of them running, governing, and all this other dumb shit, and set up all this whole big old group of stupidest shit ever, and we run with it. You know, they set up dumb shit like work, 
highways and streets and shits and divisions. And you can't go here and you can't go there. We're the children of creation. This whole earth was made for us. Okay? Quick little lesson. Then, in our creation, the ones there that saw our creation, they told y'all not about from the holy book, they were pissed. Because then they were, you know, they had to step aside a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Because we have dominion. We are the children of all existence. I keep saying it like that because I don't want you guys to keep doubting yourself, feeling less than, feeling like you want to give up, feeling like, you know, like you're not nothing when you are everything. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're the children of the one that made souls, that made souls, that gave you a breath. You're the child of that. All you have to do to be righteous is when faced with decisions, make the righteous decisions. And it's easy for us because we're not wicked creatures. We will always choose righteously. And when we even dwell in negativity, wicked shit, we don't feel right. It don't feel right. Okay? It rubs you wrong. We were born with that knowledge. But we came here where they governing every fucking thing and everything they give us is backwards and everything they give us to love is fake and false and wicked. Anyway, family, I want to encourage you every fucking day. Know who you are. We're the children of creation, of the one that made souls and breath, <laughs> made the whole human body. Have you ever looked at how the human body is made, put together? Wicked can't do that. <laughs> they can't emulate that. We are amazing beings. The way our body is made up, that's how come they feed off of us. They live off of us. They study the stem cell. <laughs> they will never fucking break that down, figure it out. Well, excuse me. They have found ways to break shit down, but they will never figure out how to fucking stop the stem cell. How we rebuild? How the human rebuild? They can never stop that. What they can do is introduce fuckery to you. All this shit that you we finding out now, they doing shit to everything. Air, water, food, everything, everything. Everything. They're doing all that shit. Because they cannot stop it. They can slow it down. Mess with it. And we don't die. We just dropped the fucking uniform. And your humans need to know that. We don't die. We dropped the fucking uniform. That's it. The soul is eternal, everlasting. I think the greatest joke that they did on these humans is make them fear leaving this motherfucker. It's an experience. We are to experience it. And we are to choose on our own if this is, if we want to hang out here, <laughs> fuck with these fucks, you know what I'm saying? Or if we want to be who the fuck we are and stand for the one that gave us a breath of soul in existence. Fuck these devils. I can't say it enough. Fuck a devil, fuck them. Stand strong, family. We are the most amazing beings here on earth. And there's nothing weak about us. Don't let them fool you. Oh no. And fuck them.